Hello everyone, welcome back to Hades The Chill. Dark Princess reveals her deepest fears only to a stoic old amphibian, which long ago hopped into her tent and into her heart. Only the deepest fears for you, Freenos. Where does Kronos find those blasted satyrs anyway? Last time we got pretty far. The they were core. all so happy together, uh, weren't they? Two areas after and oblivious to the Titan's threat. So what's up? Hail, spirit. Who summons me? Oof, you look rough. If we're being honest, Mel. Wanna talk about it? Or at least tell me the juicy bits because I'm bored? Last night I visited the morning fields and... Being surrounded by that much despair, I think I must have brought some of it home. Well, why don't I just... Scare it out of you, you wretched worm! Hey, that worked. I know, right? Interesting. The fates expected this. Still need to met, uh, meet her, uh, yeah, Hermes. Taurus again. You're awake. Headmistress, I saw him, Kronos. First beyond Erebus in the guise of an old man. He then attempted to ensnare me in some vision out of time. The river of flame, everything ablaze. Yeah, that was a cool Still, moment. your heart, Melinoe, you're safe. And you were able to return again, which means that all your training served you well. So then, he realizes who you are. So he claims. I broke free from his spell like it was second nature, but neither could I raise a hand against him. What must I do now? Nothing has changed. You're to confront him down where he resides, where your mother and father rightly ought to be. But go with patience, not with haste. He may know something of your power now, yet not enough. Yes, headmistress. How to find my way in the morning fields? Domnoski Traxon. Tis done. Sure. Katoski Anoski. Your intent was true. It is done. What now? I have need of that. Mm. Fate fabric. Mm. Fate fabric. No. Where'd Nemesis go? You look as though you've seen a ghost, if you'll forgive the very antiquated mortal turn of phrase, Goddess. So we'd say to someone looking disconcerted. Things all right? Yes and no. I saw Kronos out there. I thought he had me, but I broke free from his spell. This was in Oceanus, though I also caught him snooping near the pathways out of Erebus. Damn it. Our reports said nothing of the sort, but then... Some of our shade informants haven't yet returned. We had expected Kronos to stay put in the lowest reaches. You must have caused enough of a stir to catch his notice. Definitely not doing that. I've hardly been discreet in my approach. Is there truly no other way? We reckon not. We're counting on him thinking you're inconsequential to his plans. As for our own, I shall go over this with the good witch. Be safe, and cheers for the report. Of course. I got you something. No, still free. 
Rest well. Or well, I have some, just not suitable. What say the ashes? Oh, nice. That's what that's for. Okay, that's what psyche. So if I get eternity. Ah, darn, so close. More psyche to be able to activate the centaur. The boatman. Gee, so so many abilities. Yeah, let's let's get that two hundred. Death defiance. Healing. Slow the sorceress. Down. Something new there. Pretty good one. Might try messing around with this. The one. beam. See Celine. What secrets okay. lie within? Zorafet, the Moonstone Axe. Right, you can split them. anything apart. Requisition Looks like we'll authorized. at least be getting two more weapons. Oh, no, I can... Okay, it's just hidden to me at the moment. Chart it down. Tablet of peace. You are mine now. It shall serve you well. Another artifact of night within the pool. So can I only have one of these equipped at a time? Okay, yeah. Or I can prioritize one. Since I have stuff I need to collect with that, let's make sure that's prioritized. Our way she returns as dusk gives way to night. Within the haunted crossroads reside shades and spirits of all sorts, some resembling their mortal selves and others 
rendered down to purest essences. You all right, Homer? Commander, you once held a place of honor in my father's house. So you must know Cerberus, right? I found him in the morning fields, coated in miasma, heads to paws. Was he always prone to uncontrolled fits of rage? Oh no, he mostly sat around. <laughs> we go way back, it's just... I kept strategically afar, seeing as he's kinda like a dog and I'm kinda like a bone. So now he's giving you some trouble, huh? It's not his fault. Kronos must have cast him from the house, put him out to pasture. I broke through all the grime and calmed him down, but he may need another cleansing soon. He never did like bears, just so you know. That came straight to the bone. Or yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll at least first keep messing around with the new weapons. Can't do it. Yeah, so I go. Hey, Em. I'm oh. back. Hey. You are. Lord Hermes, go unseen. How's things? You good? I'm good, mostly. Ooh, and good to see your tasks design. underway. But change of plan, though it's like hard it. to ask. Up for a visit to Olympus sometime soon? Lord Hermes, just a moment. What do you mean, Olympus? My task is to stop Kronos in the underworld. I can hardly breathe the surface air, much less get to a mountaintop. Come on, Em. You have your ways. Perhaps is up to something bad more than his usual attack, so just give it some thought. Wouldn't ask if it was nothing, right? Okay, gotta run, and so do you. I'll be in touch by Boone. So long for now. Goodbye. In the name of Hades. Olympus needs me Ooh, on the range. surface. I wonder if that means the second path will open now. That looks like it be heading for the surface. Hmm, attacks are faster. That might be helpful with this axe. But I do enjoy the slower projectile speed of enemies. Now we make haste. Let's head this way this time. Apollo, I am grateful for all your warmth, oh, okay. benevolence, and aid. Please accept this gift. It's not fine for me. What a delightful surprise. And I haven't had a lot of those of late. Know what? I have something for you too. 
Thank you for this, cousin. Artemis always calls me little brother when we're twins. At least she never comes home empty-handed from her hunts. Just recently, she found a family relative and ally, poised to strike behind enemy lines. You are quite the prize. Yeah, I don't think increasing specials will really do much since it's just a shield. Yeah, it's interesting, like, knowing that there, there's... I haven't... I don't think I've seen any specific dash abilities. Everything is just sprint, it seems. I do definitely enjoy the sprint speed, though. Given her I call upon the moon and draw you down. The Titan Kronos. He is time itself. Thus, by his nature, we can never be entirely prepared for him. He seeks the downfall of Olympus. But how exactly? We still do not know. Which suits you? Okay, I can get to healing. Go for that. Dark side. Please accept this gift. Oh, it just makes me What's she does. doing here? Oh, hello. One word of this to Hecate, and you're meat. Got it? Now go on while I take care of things. This is my task, not yours. And I'm disappointed with your dereliction of duty. Are you so desperate to prove you're superior to me? You know, maybe I am. So how about this? Got some gold on you, right? Those wretches ought to swarm in any moment. Whoever takes more of them gets the other's coin. What do you say? Must it always be a wager with you? There are the women if you shut up and fight. Go on. to Kronos? Whatever. Surprised you didn't bail out with that return trick of yours. You don't know anything about me. What are you thinking being this far from your post? 
in violation of Headmistress Hecate's direct orders. I'm thinking you don't have what it takes to take the Titan down. I do. Now get out of here. Later. Did she just... She knocked me out. Goddess Hestia, I hope you will accept this offering. It's a pleasure to have met someone with your warmth, wisdom, and strength. Well, look at you, making me offerings. Such hospitality. And while I throw most customs to the flames, the old exchange of gifts is one that I don't mind. So here, something from me. Something from Auntie Hestia. Yeah. who sniffed you out, was it? Seems like an awful big coincidence. But then with gods, these things, they happen all the time. I'll say I'm glad she found you when she did. I mean, if I'm constantly restoring magic... That does let me keep using my invincibility, and then using it. It does let me keep using my invincibility. Hi, come sit in. Hi, Arachne. We got some cocoons for you. You've been so busy, Arachne. Not just all these dresses, but all Erebus is teeming with silken cocoons. You're certain it's all right for me to break them? Of course, you big silly. What, do you suppose they're teeming with my countless brood? By the time you see a cocoon, anything in there is either for you or was out to get you. Now here.
something for you. of some sort, my lord. I've returned as much gold as I could, but know full well it isn't easy for you to procure the goods you provide. Oh, I thank you. Redeemed this at the crossroads, is that it? That was quick. I heard from Hermes, headmistress. He gave me the impression that Olympus needs my aid. What of my task? Your task remains, as does the adversary whom you face. We shall discuss the matter with Hermes elsewhere. We have other matters first. Crossed flames burn.
mend your wounds, and neither shall your enemies. Return to Shadow now! Thank you, Headmistress. Oh, you. hello. Just in time. You seem to know your way around. I am master of this realm, yet even I would never venture into yonder woods. You even found your way back from your detour in Asphodel. Damn you, Kronos. The fates oh, cannot what? help you now. Oh, stop. Tis a pity that this granddaughter of mine is both a weakling and a fool, though an elusive one. I ought to thank the fates that we have met at last. The fates had nothing to do with this, sir. You took my family. Our family? Make not their same mistakes, and in time, we surely shall grow past this halted start to our relationship. I shall see you later. Wait! You... Interesting. At least my feet are clean. Within the sopping, blackest pits of Oceanus reside horrors that the greatest mortal or immortal poets could not possibly describe. Don't sell yourself short, Homer. For dealing with the whole bit. Lord Hermes. Olympus, I accept this message. Little spring in my step. I like that. I feel like I should have gone for the one that I continue attacking. That's that. 
The Nightmare Bringer. I walked the path. This isn't your domain. You wish to see your father's domain, do you? Is this really Asphodel? Need to get out. Every bad dream has an escape. Why do you so wish to wait from such a people? Is this truly that which you are fighting for? It'll take more than that, Kronos. Oh, Oh, that's good. 
the show. Oh, good! You're just in time for our set! I've been working on a song called I'm Gonna Claw Out Your Eyes and Drown You to Death. <laughs> Comes from a real personal place. Is it any better than the one I heard on my way in? No, it's not, because all our songs are the best. <laughs> Each like a perfect little child. Not a bad one, like you. How many uh, songs did they make for the bus fight? Those sirens. Oh, okay. Well, sirens are amphibious. You know their weaknesses, Freynos. That could have gone a little bit better, but the, uh, the, the axe is definitely an interesting weapon. Def definitely needs a daedalus hammer to, or just abilities to try to speed it up. But yeah. With that, that'll call it for today's episode of Hades 2. Hope to see you all next time.